What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the Justin Hawk Smith channel. Today's video is going to be freaking awesome. I've been waiting for this day so long. Uh, good timing. Me and Scott are headed to Tennessee today to pick up the new wheel setup for the 2006 F-250 that I have that we have been building here on the channel. We've got it all cleaned up. So I'm actually going to be taking my woman's, uh, her dad's truck because I don't want to drive this truck that far. So I'm going to be driving to their house, leaving my truck there, and then we will get in her dad's truck and drive all the way to Tennessee. It's like a three hour trip, roughly one way. So about six or seven hours worth of driving a day. So I'm not going to put up a picture of the wheels yet. I will say that they are bigger than the 24 by 14s that I'm running now. And like I said, the truck is at 12 inches of lift. And whenever I get my coilovers and the coilover buckets and everything in, we're going to go up to around 13. I'm going to get like some 12 to 14 inch coilovers. Um, but today's video is pretty much just going to be a little bit of B-roll footage. And then whenever we get there, obviously, you know, we'll show the truck that these wheels are on. They are used. Um, I want to say that he said he's put like 500 miles on them. So they should pretty much be like new. So this setup is pretty much brand new. So I'm going to go ahead and hop in the truck and we will hit the road and go get the other truck. And then we'll talk a little bit more, see if anything happens. And then we will head to Tennessee. What are you doing? What are you doing? I don't know. What are you looking for? I have phone chargers in my truck. No, it's not that. Come on, get up in there. No. Get no. up in there. No. No. Come on. <laughs> ah. Run. Ah. <laughs> you made it. You got it. <laughs> Also, guys, I just want to say, don't forget about our 2,000 subscriber giveaway. Yeah, get up in here. Get Go ahead. Jump. Jump. Like I was saying, don't forget about our 2,000 subscriber giveaway. We're giving away a Grill Tech exhaust tip or cash value of $150. Uh, it's a 6 or 8 inch outlet octagon 8 overlay. Solid aluminum exhaust tip raw shipped to you if you are the winner. So whenever we hit 2,000 subscribers, I will be posting the full video explaining every bit of that, all the information that you will need to know. And I'm going to put my seatbelt on and we're hitting the road. Tennessee, boys. Tennessee. All right, guys, so we are coming through Tennessee here. Just checking in with you. We are for an hour and 47 minutes away. So whenever we stop for fuel, I will check back in. Until then, enjoy some of this B-roll footage. We are in Tennessee. We are at a gas station, Flying J. <laughs> Let's keep trucking, we're almost there. I think it's like an hour, about an hour away. So we're over halfway there, boys. Bad time. You sitting here looking at a camera in his face. Fuel light came on. We stopped at the Flying J. And now we're at the old Weagles. <laughs> Two miles empty. I wonder how you actually say that. It's probably gonna be like a bunch of Weagles, Weagles, Woggles. What the f is another one? <laughs> Weagles. <laughs> Woggles. So the low fuel light came on. So we are going to get some fuel. Red handle. What is what is red handle? 100 percent gas. I don't have that where I came from. I don't know what that is. I don't know about all that. Anyway, we're going to get some fuel. Then we're going to be back on the road. 
We are four miles away. Golly, this dude's been mud. Look at that. Dang. That's a big old platinum, too. Anyway, we're four miles away. Now three miles away. No? Five miles away. Half what mile away. That? No, that says five minutes. Oh, 1.1 mile away. Not four miles. It was four minutes. The mileage is weird. All right. One mile away. Says we'll be there in five minutes. So I will show you the uh, the wheels whenever I get there. Or should I not? Maybe I should. Maybe I should. Maybe I should wait until the end of this video and just show them to you on the truck. All right. Anyway, getting off her back. Yes, I mean it's. So this truck is like around like an 18 inch lift and this is the truck that my wheels came off of uh, he had the wheels on three inch spacers the wheels sitting right there about to get loaded up and this thing is on a Davis off-road completely one off it's ridiculous dude like this lift is crazy literally so freaking nice fox coilovers custom sway bar in links custom sway bar uh, i think it's it's either a custom drag link or maybe the pmf one it looks custom though super super nice got the axle truss and this is one of my favorite parts on the rear axle truss it says davis off-road in the rear it says Davis off-road right here guys this thing is freaking sweet cool over mounts up here got us got their logo so cool so Tyler is either gonna be selling this truck um, with a different set of wheels or he also has the lift kit complete with axles coilovers the whole nine yards pretty much everything from the frame of the truck down for sale so you can actually buy every bit of this axles and all for 10 grand and that comes with the bolt-on cradle coilovers axles everything welded everything set up and you could literally throw it on your truck completely bolt on custom one off four link uh, and that is from davis customs 10 grand i will drop tyler's instagram username right here so you can hit up tyler if you are interested in the lift we got these babies strapped in Stopping, uh, I want to say this is Sweetwater, Tennessee, uh, at the Burger King. And we're from Kentucky, so we're actually allowed to go inside and eat. So I'm pretty excited to go inside and eat because it's been, what, like two months since we've been allowed to go inside and eat, or a month and a half, something like that. Um, but yeah, so we got the wheels. We're in Sweetwater, Tennessee, headed back home. We've got like pretty much two hours left to go. So we're an hour back into the trip on the way home. Me and Scott are gonna go inside here and eat some food. So let's see, uh, let's see what this Burger King's all about. I was like, we're eating inside of Burger King. Yeah, we're King. inside. <laughs> Guys, it's lit. We got chicken fries. I got uh, some meat and bacon because I can't have bread. I'm actually, I wouldn't say allergic, but I'm actually, I mean, I'm allergic to this too. But I try not to eat too much stuff that I'm allergic to all at once because it makes me have trouble breathing. Anyway, Scott, we're out here. Inside. There's multiple humans. <laughs> so we are actually coming through Tennessee. And one of these exits, I'm not sure which one it is. I called Josh, but he's actually out at the lake and he can't meet up right now. 
um, Josh, which is Trucks and Waters, also known as Trucks and Waters on YouTube. So y'all go subscribe to his channel. Uh, we're gonna be doing a collaboration later on this year, especially after we get this new setup on. Uh, maybe get like a truck review on his channel or something. Uh, so that's definitely gonna be something that we're gonna do. Uh, but y'all go follow Trucks and Waters. You just type that in on YouTube. He's just hit 10K, so big congratulations to Josh. You keep doing you, brother. I really, really support the channel. Anyway, just saying, y'all go check him out. Hit that subscribe button. Check him out on Instagram. Go give him a follow. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and go on home. We're about an hour out, I would say, an hour-ish. Or about an hour and 20 minutes, maybe. Uh, but as soon as we get home, gonna drop these wheels off at my house and I gotta go back to uh, Maddie's house and drop off her dad's truck which we're driving up now um, and then get my truck go back home put the wheels on and then we will show you guys what everything looks like and reveal the wheels so y'all just keep watching and comment down below what you think of them if you like the new setup Really, really appreciate y'all watching, and we're almost to 2,000 subscribers. So huge shout out to each and every one of y'all. Really appreciate it. Anyway, I'm driving by. All right, guys. So we are back. Just dropped the truck off. Now we are headed back to my house to put the wheels on. So, I'm going to go ahead and throw a little edit together of putting the wheels on, pulling the truck out, blah, 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 and then we will talk and go over a couple things. It looks so freaking good, guys. I am so, so happy with it. Wheel set up, complete, done. Pretty much brand new tires. Like I said, these have a thousand miles on them, somewhere around there, give or take. Um, but like, I don't even know if it will show it, like on camera, but these lugs are literally, I mean, this is my hand, look at this. These lugs are literally so freaking huge big 40s so they are 26 by 16 American Force AKAs I actually had these exact wheels uh, in a 24 by 14 on my white F-150 uh, of course they weren't on 40s these are on 40 1550 26 Fury Country Hunter MT's and I had the Ants before and they were a little bit older uh, of a tire so I think that they were hardened like a little bit like I think that the rubber like got like a little bit hard so they didn't ride the best and of course it was a thinner sidewall as well on that 35 but with this thicker sidewall and the Furies and from where these are literally pretty much brand new oh my gosh dude this thing drives like a completely different truck Scott do you think that done good? I think you done well. I think you done well. I think we done good boys. So I will be making more videos on this setup and showing everything more in depth and 
We still got coilovers in the front. We've got all kinds of stuff that we're gonna be doing to the truck. So if you all enjoyed today's video, please smash that thumbs up button down below and click subscribe so you get notified when I post my next video. If you click the bell, you'll get notified whenever I post another video. Um, I really, really appreciate each and every one of you. Like I said, we're almost at 2,000 subscribers, so it means a lot to me if you click that subscribe button down below and comment what you think. Uh, did I do good? Do y'all like the new setup? Tell me what you think below in the comments. I'll see you on the next one. Peace.